Hello, 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 Earthly Virgo. This is Nikki. How are you doing today? If you are new to the channel, welcome aboard. Thank you all for joining us over here on our channel, The Earthly Virgo. If you don't know it, I am a Virgo too, okay? All right, you all. If you are thinking about relocating, how would it turn out? Okay, Virgo? If you are thinking about relocating, how would it turn out? Let's see. Yeah, you're merely you're merely thinking about this, uh, possibly throwing a few a few a few ideas out there, uh, like where do you want to relocate to? Where do you want to go? Um, would it be beneficial for you? Will you be successful? Will you find love, or will love find you? Uh, possibly it's something that you're thinking about. Uh, I kind of feel like maybe you feel like you're gonna fail before you even get started. Possibly feeling like. Um, uh, that you're afraid of moving forward, that uh, maybe you feel like you're going to get there and get homesick or something bad will happen to you, or you may be just talking yourself out of it, you know? So we're going to see. If Virgo relocates, will they be okay? Yeah, there's a whole world, okay? There's a whole world out there you know, that you have yet to explore. But don't lose hope, though. Okay, you may feel overwhelmed with what's going on in your life right now and you want to change some things. Because right now, you possibly have you possibly have this energy of just being bone tired, uh, sick of things not going your way, sick of things not turning out the way you want. So, hey, why not move? Why not relocate? Why not start over fresh? You know, there's a whole world out there. Okay, I'm hearing... Um, Aladdin, the theme song from that show, the movie Aladdin, a whole new world, a, a great, fantastic point of view or whatever like that. Um, <sighs> Regina Bell and mm, 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 I always get him confused. No, people are Bryson and Regina Bell. I think I'll put that song in the comments for you to listen to. It's a, it's a whole new world. Okay. Uh, a whole new world. I'm actually thinking about moving back to my hometown where I was born in Mississippi. I may relocate there. Not going to wait next year. Okay. I th I've been thinking about relocating for quite a while. Um, like a, I want to be someplace where I have peace, you know, where there's not a lot of noise. I just want to be somewhere where it's peaceful. Okay. Let's see where it goes. If you relocate, how is it going to turn out for you? You don't know what, you know, what the turnout is. That's why you're a little worried about it, okay? Wow, I think this will be this will be good for you to relocate because right now your energy is like I'm I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired, okay? That's your energy right now or sometime in the near future. And here you are if you relocate, I think it's going to be perfect a good idea for you. It's going to be perfectly perfect for you to relocate. I think you're going to be so much more happier and satisfied. I'm hearing more satisfied, you know, uh, once you get over there to wherever it is you're thinking about relocating to. Maybe you haven't even, even found a place or thought about relocating somewhere, okay? But I definitely feel like it'll be a good idea for you. I'm hearing it'll be a good turnout for you. You're going to have a lot of um, a lot of good nuances in your life, okay? A lot of good, because this is this is you starting over. This is you saying, you know what? I can do this. I can do this. I, I can make a life for myself somewhere else, but don't have that lack of faith. You're possibly having the lack of faith in your life right now because you don't know what you're doing, what you're wanting to do. Um, questioning your, the very essence of where you live is just getting tiring. It's boring. The scenery sucks, okay? It's like, um, I feel like you, you feel like you're disconnected from the place that you're in and it's time for a move. All right. We have the nine of pentacles. You're possibly also uh, thinking about your finances, wondering, you know, where, where is it going? Um, will you get any more money or, or, or a better paying job? Or, you know, I just feel like there's a lot of things going on in your mind and you don't, you don't know what you're going to do, how you're going to do it, or who you're going to do it with. 
But I feel like this is you being financially independent, possibly on your own right now. Uh, but I do think that uh, you want better for yourself and better for your children and better financial security for yourself. And that's definitely going to lead you to there. OK, to that point, that point, this part in your life when you uh, move on. OK. Um, yes, 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 yes. Ace of Pentacles, you're going to, um, uh, I would say more money, but some of you may be moving to a place where like a lateral move, you'll make more uh, money where you're headed or just about the same. But I feel like you'll possibly find something cheaper as far as living arrangements or something like that. I feel like uh, it's going to be someplace cheaper. Uh, your rent possibly won't be as much as you're paying now. If it will, it won't it won't jump up five or six hundred dollars. You'll possibly be paying more or a little bit less. It's like a lateral move for some of you. All right. But I do see more financial stability and more financial uh independence for you or at work. You're gonna find a good job, okay? Uh even a better paying job than what you are now. All right. Better opportunities. There are better opportunities where you are, especially if you have marketable skills, especially if you've been on your job and you have a lot of experience for whatever it is that you want to do, yes, go. I'm here in Texas. Um, I'm here in New York. No, I don't know why I said New York, California or New York. Since that came out unexpectedly, there could be somebody here who's having issues with maybe alopecia or maybe you're getting some cancer treatments and you're having to shave your head bald or your hair is falling out. All right. I do see you're in your mind right now, just thinking about it. You've been thinking about it a whole lot, especially lately. So it's 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 starting to to come around to you more and more and more that hell, the struggle is the struggle. The, the struggle is real. Okay. The struggle is real. And you're figuring out I, I'm I struggle here. I can struggle anywhere. Okay. But if you can make it here, you can also make it anywhere. Too. You just gotta believe that you can. All right. Don't be afraid. I do see wish fulfillment here on a job. I'm hearing a job being a job well done. I do see you finally being satisfied with your with your life and satisfied with the status quo where you're moving to. I think where you're moving to, <clears throat> the scenery, the home, wherever. It, I think it's really going to be something beautiful, a beautiful experience for you, a beautiful change. Whew. But we have this energy here of this devil. Why is the devil here? I think this devil is representing itself here and now for you because of where you are, you're working in a toxic, a toxic environment. You're living in a toxic environment or you're, you're around a bunch of toxic people. Okay. And that's possibly the reason why you're wanting to relocate somewhere else because you're tired of all the toxicity in your life. I get it. I totally understand, Virgo. This is your life returning to a state of harmony and peace. Okay. Harmony, peace, uh, having a strong connection to your home, to your family, maybe even building a family where you're wanting to move to, where, where you're wanting to relocate to. This is going to not only give you a beautiful home. It could, if you're having a part, if you if you are married or in a relationship and you all are moving together, it's, you're just going to be so much more happier and at ease and at peace. But this could also mean when you relocate, you're going to meet your mates, the mate you're going to marry, the mate you're going to share a home with, have a, a nice block of land somewhere that the children can play, the, the grandchildren can, can play, you know, just having a nice, serene peaceful life with this person, okay? Uh, or meeting this person when you get there. It's like they're already there. They've already established their lives. But when you get there, wow, okay? Boom, love. Should you move? Should you relocate? You could already be doing something online, uh, maybe looking at some prospects, uh, getting some ideas of where you want to relocate to, where you want to work at, putting some fillers out there already, already planning, maybe writing some some things down because you're very analytical. Uh, also planning, maybe throwing away some things you don't need, giving stuff to family members, friends, um, or donating some things that you don't want to take with you. I, when I move, I'm not going. I'm going to take, of course, my cars. I'm taking that with me. A couple of TVs I have here in my clothes or anything else, psh, donate. Mm -mm. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, lovers, you're gonna find someone, you're gonna meet someone, okay? Uh, when when you do move, when you do relocate, you're gonna definitely find somebody, but you may be a little standoffish because you're in a new place, okay? I do see that. You may be a little nervous, but after a while, 
Oh, you're going to welcome a love. You're going to welcome a love in your life. I do see you dating more too. When you move, when you relocate, there's going to be a lot of people interested in the new the new kid on the block. The new kid on the block being you, Virgo. Okay. So you're going to be standoffish at first, but you are going to have your pick of the litter, literally. Okay. There's going to be a lot of people interested in you. Okay. Uh, uh, a lot of people that's going to see you and know you are not a local. They're going to know that. All right. Because uh, they know the, percent, the vicinity that you're moving to, people tend to know a, know a lot about each other. I know of each other, so they're gonna know when somebody new is in town. All right. Mm -hmm. I, I'm hearing um, that the thing from um, Alice. There's a new kid in town, and she's the gang good, fresh freckle freckle face. And the, whatever you know that song that theme song from um alice from back in the day <laughs> is it a good idea for you to relocate i really do think so is it a good idea for virgo to relocate yes we got the ten of pentacles we got you if you want to make the big bucks if you want to make a better life for yourself move on relocate yes the cards say yes, but right now you're not ready, okay? Uh, because you're not at that point to where you're you're consciously ready to pick up and move like tomorrow, next week, next month, possibly next year, but definitely not now, okay? I have here the Ten of Pentacles. If you want this lifestyle, if you want a solid foundation, a successful life, a successful marriage, relationship, whatever, by all means move, okay? The, the, the opportunity is there or the opportunity will present itself to you at the right time, at the right moment. You will know exactly when to pack up and start moving. If you're thinking about moving next year and you're not really sure about it, just casually get rid of some things, Virgo. So you won't have so much of a load when it's time for you to, to say, you know what, bye. I'll see you next year for a, bit, for a visit, you know? Okay. I see somebody heavily into their religion as well. Maybe even going working at a, a, a child care center or taking care of little children, maybe even being a teacher. Maybe you're a teacher now. You want to go to another state and teach uh, like kindergarten or young school age, um, preschool or something like that. What else, uh, what else is it called? Head Start. I'm hearing Head Start as well. Okay. Possibly deciding to leave and relocate after somebody who you loved passed away. If that's the case, I'm sorry to hear that. But you said, I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready to go. And opportunities are going to just fall fall by the wayside. It's like you're just going to have so many opportunities when you get to where you're going. Possibly even before, okay? Because you can have you got the internet. You can find a job before you can get there. Go interview for it. Get that job and say, I'll be there June 26th of next year. <laughs> you get it? Yeah, I definitely see you, um, your energy is saying, okay, cool, okay? And I think that really is going to happen. This year is just going to zoom, but I can't believe we're already in May, okay? Uh, when I first started shuffling, I did see the eight of wands. I definitely feel like this, this is going to be a fast process. Once you make your mind up, you're going to make your mind up. And if, I, if you say, I'm moving next year, it's going to happen next year because next year is going to be here as soon as you like so quick because things are happening so fast. Okay. And there's going to be a lot of opportunities coming your way a lot. All right. Stop speeding. If you're speeding, stop. Don't speed. You get a ticket. Just saying. Yeah. We got the lovers and you're going to love it there. Okay. You may meet a, a police officer, a person working for the police department or some sort of law enforcement. When you get there, like to date. Okay like to date and you may not yeah they're 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 going to really really be into you okay uh, i see a lot of opportunities that for romance and work um a lot of stability coming your way when you move yeah i think then finally when you get there you're going to be able to be at peace you're going to be able to settle down and settle into your new surroundings okay i see a lot of good things happening for you virgo but right now you're at a standstill that's why you want to move because nothing seems to be working out for you and you're saying you know i had enough i want to move i want a new life i want to i want to live near water i want to move toward happier quieter people you know we're, gonna, we're never ever going to move away from crime crime is going to be everywhere we we are no matter who we are or no matter where we live but we just got to keep ourselves prayed up and surround ourselves with the white light of the Holy Spirit and everything's going to be okay, okay?
Okay. Let's get a final message for those who are thinking about relocating, please. Hmm. I'm hearing a name. Hold on. Hmm. I don't know if Roscoe, I know you watch my readings a lot. I don't know if you're thinking about relocating, but I'm hearing your name, Roscoe. And who else am I hearing? Mm -mm -mm. It's not coming to me. Let's get a final message for Virgos thinking about relocating. Yeah, where it's hard work. It's going to be hard work to get you to where you're wanting to go, but it's it's not. Because right now, Spirit wants you to continue doing your due, due diligence to do what you need to do. Because some things in your life need to end if you want them. Okay, hold on. The next name I'm hearing is, is Porus. Porus and Roscoe. I don't know if you all are thinking about relocating or moving, but those are the names that I'm hearing and you know who you are. We got the eight of the eight of pentacles that's you doing your due, due diligence and wanting to process and move away but you got to start saving your money first all right and when you move on things are going to get better so it's like this part of your life where you're in now you're struggling you're not happy with what it is you're doing say i'm just done i'm just going to make the preparations ahead of time so i can move somewhere else and we have this son and being more happier than you've ever been in your life because finally, you are deciding to move on and you're going to get everything your heart desires. But it honestly starts with you, Virgo, the chariot. Move on, move on, move on. All right. And I think it's going to happen so quick. This year, about next year, about this time, some of you all will be on your way to a new location, a new city or state. All right. I hope this message resonates. Talk to you later.